Assalamu alaikum and good evening. My name is Amira Ali and today I have my grandfather with me, my Nana Ji, General Harun Aslam, who is a retired military officer. And I'm going to ask some questions about Field Marshal Ayub Khan. Uh, so thank you for being here, Nana Ji. Thank you. Uh, so the first question is that what were the policies at his time and were they successful? Uh, well, Amira, thank you very much uh, for having me here. And uh, I would love to answer your questions. So your first uh, question is that uh, uh, what were the policies of Ayub Khan? Uh, I think uh, his policies uh, was based on basic democracy. And uh, he um, didn't believe in adult franchise. And uh, uh, he, uh, there were elections uh, for the basic Democrats at the uh, local government level. They used to elect uh, the uh, uh, members of the assemblies and something like that. So his structure was based on basic democracy. Uh, second is that uh, he abolished all the provinces and there were two un one unit system. One unit was East Pakistan and the other was the West Pakistan. Um, and um, uh, uh, the, uh, each uh, province, East and West Pakistan had governors, their own governors. And there was a kind of a controlled democracy. People say that it was dictatorship, but I think it was controlled democracy. Um, his policy was based on industrial and agriculture development. And uh, um, uh, uh, he uh, believed in uh, a lot of progress of the country. Um, thank you. So the second question is that, were there any negative aspects during his time? Well, there were a few negative aspects and uh, because after him this happened, that happened. Uh, so there was control on the press and news and all. And uh, then there was a sense of deprivation because of this policy. There was a sense of deprivation in East Pakistan, which ultimately uh, resulted in separation of East Pakistan from West Pakistan. Uh, otherwise, uh, I don't think that uh, uh, there were very many negative aspects, but these were the major ones. Oh, thank you. And third question is that what was the most remarkable thing at this time that you still recall? Uh, well, a uh, remarkable thing I can recall is the uh, at the international level, Pakistan and the people of Pakistan, leaders of Pakistan, they enjoyed uh, great respect. We were an honorable nation. We were an honorable country. And uh, people used to respect us. And that is, I think, has declined. Another thing I remember is the PIA. Our airline, uh, which is... Uh, uh, almost ruined. It used to be the world-class airline, and in in, in Asia, they were first to uh, introduce uh, jet aircraft. Uh, um, then uh, the industrialization, the agriculture development. Uh, this is something to remember. We haven't seen that kind of development in Pakistan thereafter. Thank you. Um, thank you for your time, Nanaji, and I'm sure my classmates would really enjoy listening to this. It was my pleasure to be talking to you. Thank you very much.